Hello, today personality testing in the workplace, pros and cons. In today's competitive job market, companies are constantly seeking innovative ways to identify and hire the right talent. One method that has gained popularity in recent years is personality testing in the workplace. But what do HR experts have to say about it? Let's explore the pros and cons. And I'll share with you my experience with a personality test at the end of this video. Personality testing can offer valuable insights into a candidate's behavioral tendencies, work style, and compatibility with company culture. For us, cultural fit assessment. This test assesses whether a candidate aligns with the company's values, work environment, and team dynamics, reducing the chances of a mismatch and promoting a harmonious workplace. Team building and collaboration. Personality testing allows HR professionals to assemble diverse and complementary teams, fostering collaboration and synergy among employees with different strengths and personalities. Personal development. By understanding their own personality traits, employees can leverage their strengths, identify areas for improvement. While personality testing can provide valuable insights, it's important to acknowledge the potential drawbacks and limitations associated with these assessments. Cons. Subjectivity and bias. Personality tests may introduce subjectivity and bias into the hiring process, if not properly designed and interpreted. Employers must ensure that tests are scientifically validated and that the results are interpreted by trained professionals. Lack of predictive validity. Some experts argue that personality tests have limited predictive validity for job performance as other factors like skills, experience, and motivation also play significant roles. Invasiveness and privacy concerns. Employees may perceive personality testing as invasive into personal characteristics. Privacy concerns can arise if the information is misused or mishandled. Personality testing in the workplace can be a valuable tool when used discreetly and ethically. Remember, understanding the pros and cons is crucial for HR professionals to leverage the benefits while the limitations of personality testing. And you? What do you think? Now, as I promise you, we'll see my testing personalities journey. Gallup test focuses on your unique strengths and talents. For $20 or $60, you will get 25 pages about you. And you will know your strength and, in my case, input, developer, intellection, empathy and strategic. And you can see a short description about it. What this means input? You have a need to collect and archive. You may accumulate information, ideas, and etc. Because of your strengths, you need to stimulate your mind to broaden your perspective. You are quite comfortable being alone with your books and your thoughts. Watch out for blind spots. Input can lead to intellectual or physical clutter, overloading your mind. You might tend to give people so much information or resources that you can overload and overwhelm them. If you want to eat, you just see this colorful picture. And right now something from Poland. Fris report describes the natural way of solving problems. How much money do you need? About $60 for report plus about $60 for coach. And my way of thinking, visionary, my way of doing something, idealistic. What for do you need a coach to make interpretation? Like you see, sometimes it's really close. And I know I'm understanding, creative and peaceful.
16 personalities in 2020 and 2023. I'm still the same. Protagonist, diplomat, people mastery, but my traits will change. Right now I'm less extroverted, I'm more intuitive, I'm more feeling, I'm less judging, and I'm more assertive. Thank you for your time, and if you like my channel, please like, share, and subscribe. It will be really helpful. Thank you so much, take care, and see you next week.